Dozens of women who face the terror of cancer are sharing what they endured. Now their personal moments are meshing with a public exhibition. I would assume supporter Walt Buto with this week's Street Story. The portraits on the walls on both sides of this exhibition hold stories beyond the canvas. I quickly do this sketch, which gives me an idea of their body and their energy. Elle has been painting since she was two years old. This art has always been my therapy. She truly needed that release last year when two friends died, one from cancer. Losing two friends with young children, it shifts your perspective. Like, what am I doing? Time is the greatest gift. That trauma, that desire to slow down, became the foundation for the People Project. I'm just painting your edges now. A portrait a day in October featuring volunteer models, many fighting cancer, with several posing without clothes. Sarah Doherty was diagnosed with cancer six years ago and was the first model last year. Well, I think vulnerability is a big part of it, to really just expose yourself and at the same time connect with her. Colors cover the canvas. Like, I love that you're crusading for women and conversation fills the air then you really create a safe environment yeah they share I share we cry we laugh I mean it's a real moment of truth and vulnerability she learned quickly the topics evolved beyond cancer and the things that are brought up to me are often um, sexual abuse physical abuse domestic violence women struggling with body image disorder i just want to hear like what makes you tick for me it's art and i found that through art i'm able to heal myself heal others the models pay a fee that's donated to a charity with some of the portraits sold in a now annual art exhibition but what she creates on the canvas will always tell only part of the story and it's really a time capsule. Ten years from now, I could see a woman who modeled for me, and I'll remember that moment of conversation. When she started the People Project last October, she was not sure if she could find enough models to complete it, but now she has brought people here from coast to coast. On Main Street, Innie Greenwich, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.